Now it's time to chop some wood and you chop the baby wood, then you chop the baby wood. Hello everyone and welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Taya and this is Wabi Sabi, my Japanese city core slash cyberpunk island. Today we have a lot of things to do. Lyman is here already chilling. He always reminds me of bananas in pajamas. Every single time I can control my feelings towards him. I just see bananas in pajamas when I see Lyman. I did make a little list because there is a lot of things we need to get to today. Let me just stop you right there, past Taya. The original idea for this video is that we were going to get the campsite villager and then we were gonna try to get to three stars. Spoiler alert, that is way too much to put into one video and I ended up recording for about four hours trying to hunt to get the two villagers in that we needed. So that is gonna have to be its own video, but today we're gonna get the campsite visitor and we're gonna get Lycan's reaction to him as well. I already went and got the campsite DIY from Tom Nook so we can gather wood, softwood, and hardwood and an iron nuggets. Let's just go get that and then I can craft the campsite and then I can show you what we've got going on on Wabi Sabi. Oh, I do not have enough materials. Also, I have way too many sea creatures in my pockets that I need to donate to Blathers. Let's just drop some of these sea creatures over here so that I don't have to deal with them anymore. Yeah, the rest is repeats. Okay. We gotta collect a lot of wood, which means I'm just gonna shake these trees. Okay. Yep. See, that's why you shake the trees, okay? Gotcha. Ain't no wasp stinging me today. Map intermission. So here is the map so far for Wabi Sabi. We of course have myself and we have Lycan and then we have Lyman, Frida, Kiki, Anacotti, and Doc. I think it's super funny. This like little starting setup of villagers. I think it's super cute. I love An Anacotti especially out of all of them, and I do not know why. Kiki is an icon, love to see her here. Anyways, that is what we're working with so far. Now it's time to chop some wood, and you chop the baby wood, then you chop the baby wood, then you get some hardwood and soft wood, then you get some wood. <laughs> I don't know. That's, uh, I chopped a lot of wood is what I'm trying to say. All right, so after a little bit of work, I actually have all of the materials that I need to be able to craft the campsite and put it down somewhere. I'm still not exactly sure where I want it to go in the final variation of our island. So probably just gonna put it on the beach somewhere if I can. There it is. Let's go put it down somewhere. Will it fit? Oh, I've put a bunch of stuff down here. Will it fit right over here maybe? Oh, it will. Yeah, let's just do it. Yay. Okay, so let's go talk to Tom Nook and get this ball rolling. Ah, Taya, hello, hello. Have you found a good location for our campsite? Of course. Now that the location is settled, I can proceed with construction. Tomorrow we'll have a wonderful campsite for visitors. How exciting. Okay, I think I have to go to the shop. I want to do some dailies, donate some stuff to Blathers, talk to this leaf boy. I decided since I had leaf in the plaza and I was also uh, going to be doing some time traveling that I was going to put down some furniture items, some flowers, some bushes all over the place next to Doc's house as well because in time traveling forward I would see those flowers grown and hopefully it would contribute to the three star rating down the line which I also still thought that I would get to in this video. So here is a little speed build so to speak of me decorating around Doc's little house. I kind of gave him like a little workshop ish and a little uh, Garden here and there. He was also like looking at the flowers later on. So I feel like that was a pretty good pick for Doc Very aesthetic. I think I've peaked as a Animal Crossing island designer in this moment I think I'm gonna need a lot more flowers than that, but that's what I'm gonna do for today. 
I saw Red on my island one time, and then I have not seen him again, and I should have talked to him when he was here, but I didn't. And that was a big mistake, because I don't know when he's going to come back. We basically just need to check in on the next day, and then I will go to the next day to get the first campsite villager. So now that the campsite is built, I just have to talk to Tom Nook, and then go to the next day, and we should have our very first campsite villager. Tom Nook is already getting inquiries for the first campsite visitor, and hopefully he accepts somebody who is perfect. Okay, next day. Oh, Mabel is here! Mabel is here! Maybe we can get the shop. She's already come twice, so I think that I can get the shop today. Yay! Everything is coming together. Everything is coming together. Now for today's announcements. Today we have a visitor staying in the campsite. I'm very nervous. Okay, I don't know if I'm prepared. I don't feel like I'm ever fully prepared. So let's just go and see who this is and hope that it's someone decent. Please be someone decent. Please, please. For once, for once in the history of me having this game, I am hyped. Oh my gosh. He's not exactly cyberpunk, but he is so cute. I love him. Henry it is. Happy for once of all the campsite villagers that you can get. Oh, that's good. That is some good news. And we also have Mabel here. I'm gonna talk to Mabel for a second just to get the plot from her as well. We're just gonna speed through her dialogue and get the plot. Yes, give me that plot, girl. Let's go talk to Tom Nook. Hey, Tommy. So I have then the Taylor's kit and also the kit for Henry's home. I'm gonna put down the Abel sisters right over here. No, back more against the cliff. Perfect, yes. And I'm gonna put Henry's house on Lycan's side of the island. So let's go over there. I am just going to put Henry's house back here. Lycan can do whatever he wants with it eventually. I probably should have put him on the beach. Whoops. So that is that. We have Henry's house down. We have the Taylor's construction kit down. And I will just talk to Mabel to make sure that, you know, we're all clear on the spot. Talk to Tom Nook again and go talk to Henry again. So much talking, so much people. So again, because I thought this was going to be a very long video in which I put down two more plots and filled them and also put down some bridges and got myself to three stars, I did a lot inside of resident services, including paying off my loan, upgrading my house, getting another plot, getting a bridge, so I took care of a lot of that stuff right now, but we will get to how all of that pans out on the next video. But let's cut to the next day and Lycan's reaction to finding out that Henry is our first campsite villager. Okay, so this is the very first smug campsite villager that I had to take for this island. Okay. So we can kick him out eventually and will probably end up replacing him, but this is the very first campsite villager that we got that we had to take, and I just want to get your reaction. Okay. My first reaction. Mm, do you like him? I'm Wait, asking for your okay, reaction. Okay, okay. Yeah, because I don't want to phone. Um, you know, it's kind of... Man, what? It's kind of... Uh, I don't know. Then there's something <clears throat> that I can't describe that's kind of making me... Does he fit our island theme? No. So I would say no. Yeah. I just so, he feels more like a jungle. Yes. 
fact, he would have been perfect on yeah, the jungle. I think that's what it is because he's really cool. I like him, but I think it's just he doesn't fit. That's all. I agree. Glad we figured that out. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, Sevia. Oh my gosh. We're not <laughs> sponsored by Sevia. So that's good. That is all that I needed to know. If I run into any other villagers that I'm not sure about, I will call you back. But thank you so much for your input. That's it? Okay. Yeah, that's it. I'll be around. Thank you so much for watching today, everyone. I hope that you enjoyed seeing a new campsite villager and Lycan's reaction. And stay tuned to next time to see us get a few more villagers onto Wabi Sabi and make some progress towards getting three stars and getting started with the real work creating this cyberpunk Japanese city core island. I will see you all in the next one. Bye, everybody.